In order to set myself up for success, I try to meal plan every Sunday because the last thing I want in a busy week is to have to think about what to cook and if I have the ingredients for it. So what I normally do is, I'm very simple, I just write in my notes pad and I write down groceries that I need to buy so that I don't forget when I'm at the store. And then I just think about breakfast and lunch for the week because dinners I eat with my parents and my dad's the one that cooks. So that's kind of like a pick and choose moment. I want to eat his cooking because he spent all day cooking. My proportion that I try to do is 50% protein, 25% veggies, 25% carbs, give or take some. <laughs> I made the fattest grocery haul ever because I feel like I was just running out of food at home. So we're gonna go home and we're gonna meal prep for the week. Yeah! I finished dinner and the first thing that I'm gonna meal prep is breakfast muffins for the week. Is it silly of me to say that I was today years old when I realized cooked turkey meat is white? Why did I think it would turn brown? Like brown beef. Is that silly? I guess turkey is white meat. part about meal prepping is if I'm running late like I am today I just need to toast this and that's really all I have to do for breakfast taste test because I've never tried it and this recipe is from TikTok and most of the time is a hit or miss for me when I find TikTok recipes That's pretty good. Whoa. I think I could use a little more sauce in this. I only put a little bit of ketchup, but the cheese kind of helps. It's 2.06 and I haven't eaten my lunch yet because I've been so busy with work. But then today I have boxing, which starts at 6. So I normally just don't really eat dinner with my parents and I wait till after boxing to eat because I'm always starving. So it's good that I'm eating a late lunch. So I have to go cook that now. <laughs> I'm gonna hit my protein goal for the day, I think, for the first time ever, like officially, because I never calculate protein, but then because I meal prepped so well and I'm like actually weighing my food, this is a 50 gram protein meal, and then this morning was 50, and I only have to eat 140 a day, so I only need 40 more grams of protein. Yay! How do people do this? Bro. 
It sucks. <laughs> with 11 grams of protein is crazy. I just finished my two mile run this morning and as a little treat for waking up and doing my two miles, I'm eating this cold brew coffee yogurt. Amy, my friend, put this on. Put Amy, my friend, put me on this. My friend Amy put me on this and it is so good. Literally the best yogurt ever that tastes exactly like cold brew, but with like Greek yogurt. And it's 11 grams of protein in just this little serving. So on top of my breakfast that is 50 grams of protein, I get 11 extra one as a sweet treat. One of the perks about living at home is my dad's retired and he loves to cook and I'm a little busy with work right now. It's 1223 and I just asked him or I texted him and I was like, hey, can you help me cook it and I'll just eat it? And he's doing it for me because he loves me. Guys, I have the best people in my life. Look what Sharon just delivered me. Flowers and ice cream because I've been having a bad week. Two weeks, past month. Ah! I'm gonna cry now. It's been really, really hot here. By hot, I mean it's been like 80 to 90 degrees, which for an SF girly, that is really hot. Um, so I am up early to go on my run. I have three miles today. I'm n running in the morning is so tough because my body is not warmed up. And so I feel like I'm running through concrete every single time I run in the morning. I'd much rather be walking, but I'm slightly disappointed in myself because my slit for today is three miles, but I literally feel like I have nothing left in my tank right now. I'm halfway point, 1.5 right now, and I think I'm just gonna finish the last 0.5 walking and then go home and eat breakfast because I think that's a big part of the reason too, is like I didn't eat anything, I just drank water this morning. So I'm so tired and like no fuel to push me. Breakfast is important, people. Except I always forget. So yeah, I'll be kind to myself. Two miles is better than no miles. Let me go home and eat. Also another busy day at work and it's currently 2.35 and I'm about to go make lunch and then eat while I work because I have stuff to do still.
Everybody told you this before But you outshine the sun The type that I've been looking for I've seen you inside because I actually don't know how good this is gonna turn out. It just looks really good, but high hopes. The batter can't be that bad. Wow, you guys. That's so good. I would eat this every morning. I read a quote recently that said, um, enjoy being in the process of becoming. And I was like, that's so nice because I think for people who want to better themselves and make progress in whatever domain that is, you can kind of get too caught up in that. Mm -hmm. And actually you're not present and you're not, mm -hmm. you're not appreciating where you're at. So yeah, enjoy being while becoming.